Hi, Denise here with Dolphin Delight Designs, and today I want to show you some of the Pentart metallic type paints. I have some samplings of the different categories. Um, we have some of the delicate metallic, some of the glamour metallic, uh, acrylic metallic paint, acrylic pearl, the sparkling gel, and even a glitter paste fine. I don't, these are not all the colors. Um, these are just, you know, a few that I have, but I thought I would show you how they, the differences between them and how they look on paper, um, black versus white. So we'll quickly dive into it. Let's start first with our delicates. The first colors um, I have are rose gold. And the next one is, it's called purplish gold. Got a little bit too much on my brush. And the last one I have is gold. Obviously you can tell I've used this one quite a bit. So here's what those look like. They've got kind of a a very soft sheen to them, almost like a pearl type of sheen. And of course, the more layers, the less, um, the more opaque they would be. Okay. And we can paint some of this on some resin so that you can see what it looks like. Let's try the rose. So when painting it on the black resin, it has very good coverage. It doesn't take a lot of paint to get your coverage and it holds that beautiful sheen to it. When you paint it on a white resin, it still has a little bit different color, right? But it still has a beautiful sheen and still really great coverage covers all of the white you would only need one coat okay moving on to the glamours so here I have the antique silver I always like to dry my brush really good so that I don't get my paints watery before I put them in the paint. These are much thinner and quite a bit more glittery. This is um, dark silver. It's almost got a purplish tint to it. I don't know if you can tell in the, the color. Okay. 
again, you can see that real silvery kind of sheen to it. Then up next, I have, again, a gold glamour. So you can see that it's got quite a bit more of the glitter effect to it. Very, very shiny, sparkly. So on this one, let's do it on our clock face. This is one of the new releases of the LeBlanche molds. Love this clock. I'm not going to even... This will be in so many of my projects. Because you know I'm a steampunk girl at heart. So this is more um, see-through than the delicate paints, more of that shiny glittery effect, but you would, if you didn't want it to be see-through like that, having the black show through, um, you would want to do two coats. See what it looks like on the white. You can see the gold more, I mean you can still see the gold. But you're still seeing that white come through quite a bit. Whereas on this, see the difference? See how much white's showing through? And this one has no white coming through it. On this... I only have the um, one of each of these. Let's leave those there so we can look at them. So actually, let's do a side by side on this. So if you look at the delicates, which is this one, and then the glamours, you can see the difference in the the sheens, where this has more glitter and this more shine. I don't know how else to differentiate that, but <clears throat> so for the acrylic metallic paint, I have golden purple. So see, that's very glittery, but very, very thin. You would have to do several coats to get that to cover on the white. Same with if you were painting it on the resin. Actually, it, it seems to be a little bit darker on the resin, but still it's going to show through quite a bit. So... Not very much coverage on that. On the black, you'll see a little bit more, but you'll see more of the gold come out. That's the gold glitter in the paint. Let's see if you can see that. <clears throat> and then we have acrylic pearl. And this is going to be very similar to the Delicates. So that looks very similar to the sheen on the Delicates. Just a little bit more um, translucent, I think.
Okay. The sparkling gel. This color I have in brown gold. This one is very heavy with the glitter, the gold glitter, but you can also see the brown pigment into it also. And last but not least, I have glitter paste. So the glitter paste is thicker and this is an iridescent and you're really just going to see the glitter shine. A little bit of the brown left for my brush, but and when it dries, the paste will be completely clear and all you'll be left with is the shine. So you can't really see it on the white until you catch it in the light. It really shows up well on, on black. So we can pull them all together to look at them again one last time. When I was looking to buy these, I wanted to, you know, to try to tell myself or look for myself what the difference is. So this, again, is the delicate, has more of a pearless type shine to it. And then the Glamour is more glittery, has more of the, the little fine grits of glitter. I don't know if you can see that. Whereas that's more metallic shine. You can see the difference between the two. And then the um, metallic acrylic has that glitter in it versus the metallic pearl, which again is more pearlescent. So it, it's very slim, similar. You know, just little slight differences. So I hope you found that a little bit helpful when you're doing your shopping for the colors. Um, there are a lot more colors, of course, than I have listed here. I will put down on the links, uh, the link to the Royal Court retailers so that you can find a retailer in your area that sells the Pentart products. And I will see you later. Thanks. Bye.